it is hot like hot hot but guess what trader joe's has air the trader joe's is under a garage we're gonna go and get some essential items from trader joe's so not my full you know we just got paid grocery store run i'm a little annoyed because i forgot my bags i need to just keep some in the car because in northern virginia you have a bag tax it's like five cents i don't know why i'm stressed about five cents but it's something about a bag tax that i just don't fuck with i was already into reusable bags and things when i was in richmond so it's kind of second nature but keeping them in the car will definitely help me a lot let's go to trader joe's Let's get some items and let's skirt skirt out of there without spending a ton of money. Let's see. Your boy got the full body do rag out. Drop the roof and let you smoke it. I got diamonds doing since he slides in both ears. Dice rolling on the Las Vegas trip tonight. Slip that on and we might miss the fight. Fucking not, I keep the koala in my shorty bag. You know she want a mom when she tattooed that ass. I'm a lover boy, she love the toys. Keep it coming, you a rider. It's that roll myself a day and count my biggest shit. It's that stepping out, I feel like I'm that nigga shit. Three hours later. Okay, that didn't go as planned. Got some things that I needed, so. I guess I just won't be going shopping for another week or so, but I love Trader Joe's so much. That's the problem. I'm the only person that can't get out of the grocery store parking lot without eating something first. These JoJo's are like $2.99 a pack. If it's just like vanilla Oreos, they might be better than vanilla Oreos and they are so good. I only get them a few times. I don't get them all the time, but today I needed some JoJo's. About how often are you all going grocery shopping now with inflation and all of the things? Are you going once a week, twice a month? I grew up very much so an everyday grocery girl. I did not know that was not normal until I went to college. My dad goes to the grocery store every day. I think it's his escape so he doesn't have to stay in the house with a whole bunch of women. Made it back to the crib, but I did not expect to make um, groceries, groceries. So I need to go upstairs and get my wagon. I grab the frozen items before they melt because it's hot as shit. So hit the people come. Eucalyptus, the small, petite, and rice flour. I don't know, but I was trying to do the dead flour thing, which I mean, it was giving a little bit. I don't know. Don't judge me, y'all. So I'm gonna put some new ones in and let those dry out. All right. I'm gonna tell you some of my favorite things and then some of the things that are new that I'm trying. I like to go to Trader Joe's and get like my staple items and then a few things that are new that I'm not too sure about. The Brazil nut butter, body butter, and these three candles, highly recommend. I haven't tried the candles yet, but this body butter, get you some. It's hydrating, it smells so good, and it's just perfect for summer. So this is something that I, get a lot of pushback on because people don't believe me, but this Trader Joe's macaroni and cheese, and I know y'all see the melanin, so this tastes like baked macaroni and cheese. No cap, y'all. Just add a little cheese to it, add some seasonings, of course, but 
This macaroni and cheese is not giving you frozen mac and cheese. And I know what you're thinking, but for real, try it. We're still in the frozen food section, but this pasta, uh, pesto linguine with some tomatoes, goat, goat, goat. Put this with some fish. I'm going to actually pair it with some shrimp this time, but you cannot go wrong. All of these are just great work from home things to just keep in the fridge for you know a quick little 30 minute lunch this is this is it this is that great with this panini marinara it has like a little spice to it and i usually go with some of these meatballs and call it a day you know i would double up on this i usually buy two of these because it's not as saucy as i would like but it's still it's a strong contender if you don't know now you know change the game um, i did get this general so stir fry from trader joe's that i'm interested in trying because i just really enjoy like their asian cuisine so i think this is going to be interesting so on the try list is this rainbow trout filet mm, i'm trying to i'm dabbling in pescatarian and i'm thinking this might be okay i usually get the salmon pack but they were all out so we're gonna try the rainbow trout. I don't know what the fuck trout tastes like, but we're gonna see. And else I'm trying is this garlic sauce Thai noodles. I saw it in somebody, that's always how it is. You see it in somebody else's cart and you're like, that might be good. Let me see, what aisle did they get that in? So that's what happened with these Thai noodles. I have a feeling that they're gonna be tasty and I have some shrimp too. And I think that's gonna be pretty good. And I know y'all saw me crushing those JoJo's, but I forgot I also got these oatmeal cookies with cranberry and white chocolate. Now, did I need both of these cookies? No, but treat yourself, you know? <laughs> the rest of the things are just like, you know, stocking up on some veggies, stocking up on some seasonings. Oh, the seasonings, let me tell y'all. JoJo's seasonings are not to be played around with. The seasoning section is probably my favorite section because they're affordable, one. I know, I don't know if y'all know, but seasonings can get expensive. But I love the combination that Trader Joe's has of their seasonings. So I went with the onion salt, which is probably like $1.99, $2.99 at the most. And then the citrus garlic seasoning. That girl, because I got the rainbow trout. They're gonna put some of this on there and I think it's gonna be a good time. I'm about to put these groceries away. Thanks for coming to Trader Joe's with me, y'all. I just, you know, needed to stock my fridge up. I probably won't go to the grocery store. I hope I don't have to go to the grocery store next week. I think I'm good to go. I hope this inspired you to get some things from Trader Joe's, try it out. I love Trader Joe's because it has really made me fall back in love with grocery shopping. It's not as boring as the other grocery stores. Like every time I go, I see something new. I try something new and let me know what your staples are. And yeah, see you on the next one. Real quick, these candles smell so good.